Hello everyone, welcome to our channel V52 that is all about DIY electronics projects with Arduino, Raspberry Pi, ESP266 and other popular boards. In today's tutorial, we will make a project on gesture-based TV remote control using ultrasonic sensor interfacing with Arduino Uno. Here the hex code we are using for Sony TV, but we are using RGB LED where all the commands will be shown on serial monitor and with different colors on RGB. You can interface with your TV where swiping over it within the specified range in code shows different colors on RGB and different operation if you are using TV. So let's start. We will need these components to make this project. Arduino Uno with USB cable, HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor, 400 point breadboard, RGB LED, IR transmitter LED, 220 ohm register, and some male to male and male to female jumper wires. You can purchase all these components from our website and the link is given in the description. So let's start making the project. And here is the circuit diagram. So first of all, we will connect the five volt pin of Arduino Uno with the positive rail on the breadboard for making further positive connections. Then connect the ground pin of Arduino Uno to the negative rail on the breadboard for making further negative connections. Now we will connect the ultrasonic sensor with the Arduino Uno. So connect the VCC pin of ultrasonic sensor with the positive rail on the breadboard. Then connect the trigger pin of ultrasonic sensor with the digital pin 8 of Arduino Uno. Now connect the echo pin of ultrasonic sensor with the digital pin 7 of Arduino Uno. Connect the ground pin of ultrasonic sensor with the negative rail on the breadboard. Now we will connect the RGB LED with the Arduino Uno. So the first pin is for red, the second pin is ground, the third pin is green and the fourth pin is for blue. So connect it to the breadboard. Connect the first pin that is the red pin with the 11 pin of Arduino Uno. Now connect the second pin of RGB LED with the positive rail on the breadboard. Then connect the third pin with the digital 10 pin of Arduino Uno. In the last connect the fourth pin. with the digital pin 9 of Arduino Uno. Now we will connect the IR transmitter to the Arduino. The longer leg is anode and the shorter leg is cathode. So connect it to the Arduino. So now connect the anode pin of IR LED with the digital pin 3 of Arduino Uno via 220 ohm register. Now connect the cathode pin of IR LED with the negative rail on the breadboard. Make sure your LED module has built in registers, otherwise you will damage the IR LED. So. As you can see, all the connections are completed. So now we will upload the code and here it is. But before uploading the code, you need to install the IR remote library. So to install the library, go to sketch, then include library and then add .zip library. Go to the location where the library is downloaded. Now add this library. As you can see, the library is added. Now, click to the upload button. So when you're swiping over the sensor within three inches, 
will cause the LED to flash blue. And you can check the serial command power on or off on the serial monitor. This is the confirmation that a turn on or off signal is ready to be sent. To prevent it accidentally turning the TV off, we have made the sketch wait for a second swipe within 5 seconds of the first to confirm. At this point, the signal is sent to the TV to turn on or off. The second one is channel changing. When you swipe between the 10 to 20 inches will cause the channel to change up. And the LED will flash purple. And when you swipe within 10 inches but no within the 3 inches will cause the channel down. Now the third one is volume changing. Holding your hand between the 10 to 20 inches will cause the volume to change up. The volume will continue to change up until your hand is removed. And when you holding your hand within 10 inches of the sensor but not within the 3 inches will cause the volume to down and the LED will flashes clean. Similarly, the volume will continue to change up or down until your hand is removed and LED will flash green. So this is how you can make the gesture based TV remote control. If you are having some issues with project, please check out these troubleshooting points in the next slide. So I hope this video will be helpful for you. Subscribe our channel to get more video updates. Thank you. Thank you.